What's up, family? Let's go ahead and talk about some new bills being proposed right now for every American person. So if you are a citizen living in the United States, you're going to want to watch this video until the very end. Finally, we are talking about $2,000 bonus checks are on the table, which could be in the form of a fourth stimulus check. I've got the details to share with you in just a moment. Now, in addition to that, we also have some new monthly checks that are being on the table right now as well. Uh, this is bringing back one of the most popular programs that we have seen over the last decade. And this could bring $300 monthly payments to a lot of individuals. But anyways, guys, before we get started or go any further, make sure that you take the time to consider subscribing to the channel as well as hit the like button as it really helps us grow on YouTube. Now let's go ahead and start with the video. Starting off, guys, we do want to talk about a latest uh, stimulus check update. Uh, yes, guys, right here on USA Today, it says that the child tax credit is getting a new chance for $300 monthly stimulus checks. In addition to that, guys, we also have information in regards to what they are calling a $2,000 baby bonus. Yes, guys, as you can see right here that about 250 U.S. lawmakers are now trying to put a $300 per month child tax credit payment check back into the Americans' wallets, and this time with a $2,000 baby bonus to go in addition to that. Yes, guys, it's pretty much a Democratic proposal with enough Republican support and seems like more than a wish list and uh, would make permanent the expanded child tax credit, which was signed into law under the American Rescue Plan. Now, this particular legislation, uh, one of President Joe Biden's signature programs while he was in office, ended up boosting the 2021 tax credit with the most significant increases going to lower income families that have children. But anyways, guys, this particular new proposal that is on the table right now, it has several different pieces uh, within this particular piece of legislation. Uh, number one, guys, it says that it would actually remove an earnings requirement for the full tax credit that you receive every single year. Uh, the second piece is that it would actually expand the maximum child tax credit to $250 per month. In addition to that, guys, it would also continue the young child tax credit of $300 per month for children six years old and younger. And also, guys, check this one out, guys. It would actually provide what they are calling a baby bonus, which is going to be an additional extra $2,000 in the month a new baby is actually born. Uh, yes, guys, this particular information is coming out of the wire. This information, this article came out yesterday, and I'm super excited to share it with you today because on paper, it is looking very good, guys. I definitely want to share that with you anyways. But uh, it says that uh, according to the fact sheet from the office of Representative Rosa DeLauro, which is a Democrat of Connecticut, this information came directly directly from her office. Now, again, it begs the question, who is actually leading the push for this particular new piece of stimulus check update information? Well, guys, uh, Representative Delario introduced the legislation back in June, saying that the expanded monthly payments have already helped parents end up paying their bills, helping keeping healthy and nutritious food on the table for many families, as well as helping individuals afford school clothes, as well as supplies. In addition to that, it has also helped pay for a music lesson or a new pair of cleats or either manage a mortgage or either their rent payment. So guys, we have seen in the past where this has pretty much helped out a lot of low income families in multiple ways as you can see right here, which is why we are seeing this piece of legislation being supported in Congress as well as other pieces of legislation that we'll talk about in just a moment that is also trying to bring back the child tax credit. We know how super grateful this particular program was and uh, we know that the study also showed that the expanded child tax credit ended up leading Americans to more of an improved health as well as introducing uh, additional improvement on the nutrition among adults, as well as it has also helped uh, bring out so many families, so many individuals from being in poverty. So yes, guys, like I said, this is one of the best programs that we have seen in over the last decade in which 
lawmakers, Congress, as well as other statewide uh, local pieces of legislation is also trying to bring back the child tax credit as well. So this is definitely some very exciting news that we are seeing right here, guys. And as I stated earlier in this particular article, it talks about more than 250 lawmakers are now supporting this particular piece of legislation. Uh, but anyways, guys, Representative Susan, uh, which is another sponsor of the legislation, called on her fellow lawmakers to be on top of the American Rescue Plan by permanently reinstating this monthly benefit to ensure that every child has a fair chance at success. So anyways, guys, like I said, this is fresh off the wire. This information came out yesterday and I am sharing it with you today. So, uh, yes, guys, we are definitely excited to see this information. I will keep you guys posted as usual as we continue to get more developments on this new piece of legislation, bringing back the most popular $300 per month in monthly payments, as well as an additional bonus check of $2,000. But anyways, guys, in addition to that, as we are already talking about the child tax credit, I do want to go ahead and talk about this particular article that came out last month as well. In June, uh, there was a house proposal that would actually restore the expanded and improved monthly child tax credits. Now, we did talk about this previously on another video, but I do want to remind you about this as a particular group of U.S. representatives have already introduced the American Family Act, which is a new piece of legislation that would make the previously expanded monthly child tax credit permanent. So, yes, guys we talked about it on the previous article and we have another article that came out earlier last month both of them are trying to bring back the child tax credit permanently but this one is specifically called the american family act so i definitely want to share that with you as well and then in addition to that we also have shockingly enough uh, we have one state that it did bring back the child tax credit just for their state, guys. It's the state of Oregon. They ended up launching what they are calling their Oregon child tax credit, which ended up gaining some traction in the state of Oregon. And as you can see right here, guys, it says that Oregon is poised to join a handful of other states that guarantee a direct cash payment to its poorest families, mimicking what they are calling the federal program that briefly fueled a dramatic decrease in child poverty levels coast to coast before it was dismantled back in 2022 and the legislature's joint committee on tax expenditures ended up passing a bill uh, last Tuesday that would establish a $1,000 per year in what's called an Oregon kids credit at a cost of around $37.5 million per year. Now this particular proposal now moves to the house for consideration and like I said guys uh, they are saying that instead Oregon will grant single parents or families who make up to $25,000 per year a $1,000 annual credit for every child under the age of six years old in their household with smaller credits available for families with incomes up to $30,000. So anyways guys like I said the state of Oregon they have just passed this piece of legislation and hopefully guys they can be able to see this come to fruition giving out $1,000 per child under the age of six years old. So again, guys, we are seeing this on a state level. We might start seeing more states even offering this as well. But so far, guys, this is the only state that I know that has actually brought back the child tax credit. But hopefully we can get this actually done on a federal level. So anyways, guys, like I said, we have some great information in this particular video today. And I definitely was excited to share it with you talking about uh, bringing back the $300 monthly child tax credit. Uh, that is going to be awesome, as well as an additional $2,000 bonus check for those individuals that ended up having a child that is going to be a huge game changer guys so uh, but anyways guys hey I hope all this information in this video was helpful to you today well, anyways, guys, hey, that's all I have for you today. But feel free to check out some of the items down below in the description. There are a few ways for you to be able to earn some free money or some free cash. Yes, if you sign up with Webull and you are a new customer and deposit $1, they are going to give you 12 free stocks. Now, the beauty is those 12 free stocks can actually be worth up to $3,000. And all you have to do, guys, is just deposit $1. And then you can sell those stocks after they clear. 
But anyways, guys, that is just a few, but be sure to check out all of the links down below in the description. But anyways, if you enjoyed today's content and you want to see more, please go ahead, subscribe to the channel. It's totally free. And if you like today's video, then go ahead and hit the like button for us. It really helps out this channel as well as it tells YouTube to share this video with others. But anyways, guys, hey, I appreciate you guys stopping by and watching, and I hope to see you on the next video. Peace.